Holy crap, guys, the day has come. The Inzoi Character Studio just dropped a couple days ago, so we're gonna be checking that out today. It is basically a hyper-realistic life simulator game. Uh, it is supposed to be one of The Sims' biggest competitors. A lot of Sim fans are claiming that they'll switch to Enzoi for good once it's fully released, which is crazy. Uh, it's supposed to be fully released later on this year. They're estimating November. They're also going to be releasing it on console later after that. I'm so sorry, console always seems to get the, the shit end of the stick every time. <laughs> So anyway, the full game is not out yet. I am currently trying to get early access so I can check out the whole game with you guys. But the character studio, which is like create a sim, has already come out. It is free on Steam right now until... I think it's only free for a certain amount of time. Uh, let me check. Until the 25th, so <laughs> two days after I upload this video. Um, so if you want to try it, just make it snappy, you know, but we're gonna be checking it out today. I'm super excited. The creative sim was like one of the things that grabbed my attention. Definitely. It looks insane. But anyway, if you're new here, what's up? I'm Sav. Very nice to meet you. Uh, I usually play the Sims, so having a game that could potentially compete with the Sims is honestly insane because I've been playing it since I was really little. It was one of the first games I ever played. So like, and nothing. There hasn't really been a life simulator game that has come out that is like worthy of competing with The Sims. So like having something is just insane to me. <laughs> I'm really excited to check this game out with you guys. Yeah, like I said, today we're doing the character studio thing, which is like create a sim. So let's just hop in, shall we? All right, here we are. My game, it was like 20 gigs, I think, on Steam to download. Yeah, let's just make my sim self today. That should be super straightforward and easy for me. Um, okay. Create a Zoe. <gasps> oh my god, this is so insane. What does Savannah Compost look like? Create an appearance for Savannah Compost. Profile, sexual identity in development. Okay, fair enough. Age group. Oh wow, okay, so we got child, young adult, adult, middle aged, and senior. Wow, we got a middle-aged option. That's cool. What are these options or icons up here? Filter, photo mode, facial capture, photo mode. Oh my gosh. Sorry, you guys can't see. Hold on a second. What if I Okay, that's a little bit better. You guys can see a little more. Um, all right, so select a trait. Changes cannot be made after creation. Okay. Wow, it's a whole bubble map. <laughs> Select a trait category. <gasps> this is so cool. This is so cool. Oh my God, I don't even know. It's asking, it's like when you have to say a fun fact about yourself in class and you don't know what to say. Definitely a perfectionist, so. Oh, okay, so you can only pick one of these. Wow, look at how freaking detailed this is. I literally, whoa. Okay, hold on. Meticulous and thorough, keywords, rational, responsible, methodical, principled, ethical, composed, values, coexistence, rule abiding, accomplishment, traditionalist, setting high standards for themselves and others. The perfectionist always strives to handle everything flawlessly, making rational decisions with a fair attitude. Their sense of responsibility and justice is strong. I characteristics prioritizes and prioritizes orderliness and a regular routine. Frequently feels nervous, surprised, feeling lasts for a shorter time. Hygiene gauge decreases quickly. Dude. I can't even believe how insane. This definitely feels it feels more mature. Uh like the Sims like kind of has like that kooky kind of like vibe to it you know uh, where there's always sarcasm and jokes in the description and stuff but this feels way more <laughs> way more serious which honestly i love um i like it a lot artistic introverted safety conscious oh i think perfectionist honestly describes me so well so i'm gonna i'm gonna do that one okay so we got some presets apply pre yes i haven't done anything yet Okay, cool. So I guess this is kind of like the randomize a sim thingy. Ooh, look at her. Oh, what the? 
Okay, this is so weird. I need to <laughs> unlearn my um, my like Sims uh, reflexes. You know? Do you know what I mean? Ooh. Oh my god, dude, this is so cool. I'm getting like giddy right now. Okay, I can't. Okay, there's nothing we can. Let me go to face. Okay. Um, holy crap, this feels. <laughs> it feels illegal. It feels like I gained access to a to some kind of very advanced technology. I don't know how to explain it, guys. So detailed edit mode. Yeah, I want that because I want to change the nose a bit. Wow. I cannot believe, like, this is such a trip. It's just, I don't know. It's weird having something else, you know? It is, uh... It's so cool though. I don't know why I can't change the chin. Um, yeah, I don't know how to like rotate either. Okay, I took off all the makeup. I honestly like the lashes. It looks like the lashes just stay on which is pretty interesting. I need to change the brow. Can I change the brows? How do I change the brow type? Also, why can't I change the chin? <laughs> I find that very, this is looking nothing like me because I just don't know how to do it. Uh, but anyway, I wanna put some blush on and some freckles, of course. Color, oh my God, wow. There's a freaking color wheel, y'all as there should be, you know? Okay, that looks pretty cool. Freckles are fine. Okay, yeah. Wow. That's so cool. <laughs> it's just so detailed, it's honestly crazy. What is the difference between these? Is it just the color? Um. Whoa, okay, wow, insane. Brow crease, cheeks, chin cleft, jawline. What does this do? Oh, it makes the jawline like more chiseled. Insane nasal bridge. <gasps> Holy crap, eye bags. Oh my God. Yeah, let me give me some, some of those. Oh my goodness. I'm actually, this is so cool, you guys. I, <laughs> I can't say it enough. This is dope. Wow, okay. Upload to canvas. What's that? Is that like a gallery, dude? Holy crap. Okay, let's find a hair. Um, I don't know. I change my hair all the time, so I can pretty much just pick whatever. But yeah, the hair is <laughs> it's basically Sims 4 Alpha Alpha CC version. I'm tripping out right now. This is so I can't explain the feeling. I really can't. It's like playing Sims in the future. It's like alternate universe Sims. I'm, I'm tripping, I'm tripping balls, guys. Oh, the curly hair is so beautiful too. How? How did they nail it first freaking try? Come on now. Okay, that hair is so cute. I kind of want to get my hair cut like this in real life. <laughs> it's so adorable. I wonder if they're gonna come out with packs and like if we're gonna have to pay do you know what i mean just like the sims or if it's gonna be if they're just gonna update it every so often with free stuff that's pretty good edge softness what is that i don't know what that did but hold up length <gasps> Yo! Oh my god, you can take any hair and change the length on it. Dude, uh, Are you joking? <laughs> I didn't mean to zoom in that far, but... 
Are you freaking joking? Are you? My eyes just got so wide, so I might as well make her eyes wide as well. Feel me? General. I don't know what that is. Are these just more hairs? I don't know. Anyway, dope. Very dope. Um, let's change the eyes. I wish my eyes were this beautiful gray blue, but no. They're boring ass brown. Ooh, we got some fun contacts as well. <gasps> How cool! Oh my god, I kind of want to do a fun contact. Oh, with the ring light and the reflection. Stop. Okay, this is no longer my sim self. Outer iris. Oh, that's dope. Iris size. <gasps> Pupil size? Oh my god, how neat is that? Seriously, guys, I can't get over that. Oh, here we go. Eyebrows and eyelashes. Okay. Yeah, that's pretty good for eyebrows. <gasps> Excuse me. Okay. Um, and then eyelashes. Wow. You can change the color of the eyelashes too. That is so freaking cool, guys. <laughs> All right, now makeup. Um, I do wear wing liner, so let's put some of that on. I just want the top wing though. Okay, I guess that one works. Eyeshadow, blush, lipstick. Mm, oh my God, you can overline, underline, line, very much so. Oh man, I don't know, do I like the matte or the gloss? I think I like the matte. Wow, this is incredible. I am just in awe right now. I think I may have made her a little bit too wide-eyed. All right, well, I think <laughs> the face is done. She's so much more pretty and sn snatched than I am, but <laughs> it's okay. Practice makes perfect, am I right? All right, body. Let's give her a little bit more weight here. Muscle. Yeah, I don't have like any muscle. I'm not even gonna lie. How do you make the boobs bigger? You can't? Really? Well, that's just mean. Okay, outfit. Hmm, wow. Is the skirt already clipping because I made myself a little bit heavier? That's wild. Anyway, um, so we've got outfit presets. C-L-O-N-M-D. I don't know what that means. Uh, these outfits were created by designers using CLO and Marvelous Designer. Okay. All right, so here are some of the full body, like pre-styled outfits that we have. Um, I like them. They're very stylish. They're very trendy, which I'm, I'm not surprised. I think this game was developed in South Korea, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, so you can go to tops, right? And then it's, um, you can do either shirts, sweatshirts, hoodies, t-shirt, tank top, vests. So it's very organized and I feel like it would be really easy to find, um, to find stuff. Let's see. We got outerwear, coats, windbreakers, jackets, cardigans. Everything is just so, it's so organized. Sets, long dresses, mini dresses. Wait, hold on. Let me, um, you can take things off right from here in this section, which is kind of cool. Jumpsuits, swimsuits. Aww, how adorable. Also, I don't see, like, I don't see, I only see, <laughs> I don't know how to say this. I only see an option for one outfit. I don't know if, like, more, um, like outfit slots are coming later and we'll be able to ch to change and stuff. But yeah, I'm only seeing the one right now. Yeah, there's leggings, there's shorts, there, there's just a lot of options for a base game. It doesn't look like these skirts work though, if you're over a certain uh, weight. I'm gonna go for these cargo pants. I love cargo pants right now. I've been wearing them a lot lately. <laughs> They're just so comfortable. You can't be comfort, am I right? Moving on to shoes, there's heels, a couple boots. Mmm, sandals, Crocs, <laughs> slip-ons, there's sneakers. Wow. I'm gonna just do some white sneakers, I think. 
What else? Oh my god, you can choose the underwear. Huh. That's refreshing. You can't do that in The Sims unless uh, you have a mod for it. Accessories, socks, and then you can add outerwear to any outfit. That's next level as well. <laughs> that is seriously so cool. Gosh, there's so many options. I am an outerwear girly. I freaking love jackets. That's kind of cool. It's clipping a little with our arms because it's so oversized, but I like the vibe of this. Customized outfit? Like, even more? What do you mean? I'm confused. What? Holy crap! I'm confused. I'm not even wearing that shirt. I want to do the pants, but I'm not even wearing these pants. Huh? I don't know. That's a little, that's a little confusing, but that's okay. All right, moving on to accessories. There are a ton of hats and they are so freaking cute. Oh my God. Help me. A corduroy hat, bucket hats. We got oh, these little beret things. Beanies, sun hats. Oh my God, I love this hat so much. Let's do that to match the shirt, I suppose. Oh, wow. <laughs> so cute. Eyewear, we've got regular glasses, sunglasses. Wow. Oh my God. It's just so, uh, whoever like came up with the designs is, it was like they hired like a fashion student or something, or just someone that's like chronically online or someone that has really, really good style or taste. So cool. I don't think I want to put glasses on, but I wanted to show you guys. And we got necklaces, a choker, a couple of chokers. Wow. <laughs> really fancy. A chain, a couple chains. I love the chain. The earrings, we can't really uh, see. Actually, we can see them. There's diamond earrings, dangly earrings. I'm surprised I don't... Oh, there's some diamond hoops. I'm surprised I don't see any just... Oh, they have ear cuffs. Butterflies. I'm surprised I don't see any just like regular gold hoops. Oh, there's there is. They're right here. They're just silver. Whoa. Main color. How do I make gold? Like that. Texture. Are you joking? You could turn up or turn down the gloss. The pattern scale. Oh my god. Who would have known that you could customize your jewelry in this game? They really went above and beyond with all this, didn't they? We got some hair accessories. Oh, you can layer. You can layer. Oh, how cool! Headphones in base game. <laughs> Cat ears, a tiara, another pair of headphones. Wow. N and then nails. Oh my god. How cute! These nails scream me. They need to be a little bit longer though. I wonder if you can, if you can customize the length. Ooh, those are pretty too. What are these? No, I want these, but... Dang it, it doesn't like you look like you can make them longer. You can do it with the hair, but not, not the nails. <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> okay, let's just do these. All right, so accessories, hats, eyewear, necklaces, earrings, hair, thingies, and nails. Everything that you have on your sim is listed right here on the left, so you can take it off anytime you need to. I still don't know how to, like, rotate. What is filter realistic huh hold on a sec oh my god dude you can change it you can change the graphic style you can put a freaking fil filter on i don't see the point of that one but Whoa. 
I honestly think I like realistic the best. I'm not really sure though. What do you guys prefer? Cartoon or realistic? Oh wow, that is so dope. Okay, and then we got photo mode. And it saves into, wow. Oh, move in, out, left, right, move up, down. Move camera position. Oh, okay. So that's how you move the camera position. Wait. Oh. Okay. I figured out how to rotate, guys. Figured it out. Expressionless. <gasps> guys! You can make them have certain expressions. Are you kidding? I'm... I'm screaming. Pose, raise left arm, shoot money gun. What the hell? That's so random. Pose for photo. <laughs> Look at her go. Oh my God. She's doing all the poses. Wow. Get it, girl. Is she literally doing TikTok dances? Is she? Uh... <laughs> she totally is. Wow, that's nice. Couple wedding. What? Sofa. Oh my. What the hell? What is happening right now? Laundry room. This is honestly insane. I can't even... Okay, hold on a second. <laughs> this is gonna be a lot of like me being silent and just showing you guys everything. Oh my goodness. Move gently. Yes, indeed. Let's see that money gun again. How silly. What is facial capture? Wait, what? Facial capture setup guide? <gasps> You're telling me that you can take a picture of yourself? and it'll capture your facial features and import it? Is that what is that what that is? That would be actually insane. I don't even I don't even have words for that. I wish I could give her more than one trait. But that's okay. Um there's a lot of things that are still in development, but we were basically able to see the entire creative zoi process. Um, would you like to save the current Zoe to Zoe presets? Sure. Add family. <gasps> oh my god! You can just create a family tree straight from- Wow, that's so cool. I am- um, I'm tripping. That was so much fun, you guys. I have so many questions. I am so excited to play this. I'm just blown away by the detail, really. And- the graphics are honestly like really refreshing. I'm so used to cartoony Sims graphics. So like having like a realistic version is so, it just feels like alternate universe. I don't really know how to explain it. <laughs> it was kind of like playing Stardew Valley and then playing Coral Island. If you guys are interested in playing with this for yourself, it's free right now on Steam. You just need 20 gigabytes of space on your hard drive, I believe it was. Yeah, 18.9 gigs. Big apologies to everyone on console. I'm so sorry that you can't. You can't play this yet, but it is coming coming to console. It's coming to PC later on this year. I love you guys so much. Thank you for watching me play Enzoi for the first time. Leave me comments, let me know what you think, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!